I want to focus on Microsoft PowerPoint. Uh, PowerPoint. For now, I'm just going to give you a bit of revision from level three. Uh, PowerPoint is a slideshow presentation program where you can create different slideshows with different slides in it. You can add pictures, you can add um, graphics, you can add uh, shapes or smart art or charts. Uh, if you remember correctly, in level three, you, you just started with, with PowerPoint. You had to insert new slides. On the left-hand side, there's all your slides that will appear that you can click on depending on which one you want to work with. You can change the layout of a slide. If you go to layout, click on the little arrow, there's different layouts for different slides. So make sure what your instruction says, what your layout must be for your slide, and then you choose it. Even if the slides are there already, you can just click on the slide, you can go to layout, and you can change it to another layout. First one, we can click on it, we can change it to another layout. If you remember correctly in, in level three, you just did the basic you created a little PowerPoint presentation where you added your text and you typed in your text and your picture maybe and so on. In level four, we are going to focus a lot more on changing and editing existing PowerPoint presentations. So you will not be asked to, op to type a PowerPoint presentation. You will open an existing one and then you will have to make changes to that existing PowerPoint presentation. So again, just a recap, how do I insert a picture? Click on insert, click on picture. I go to my desktop because that's most probably where your, your pictures will be saved. There's my student files. I choose the correct picture, click on it, and I say insert. Then I can make it bigger and smaller to what the instructions tell me my picture must be. I can place it in the correct position. Must it be on the right? Must it be on the left? Must it be in the center? Please read your instructions because that's very important. You will get marks for positioning of the picture. On the top here, right-hand corner, you will see the height and the width of the picture. If they give you a specific height or a specific width, that's where you're gonna change it. So either you make it bigger. Like you see, if you change one, the other one changes automatically. So if your height needs to be 10 centimeters, then you make your height 10 centimeters, you move your picture so that it's visible and nothing is cut off. How do I delete a picture? As you can see, my picture is selected. There's a block around it. As soon as my picture is selected, I can just press delete on my keyboard and the picture will be deleted. As normal, I can change my font uh, in my presentation. I highlight, always highlight before I change anything. I go to font, I go to whatever font they tell me. I go to font size, I can make it the size they tell me to make it. I can make it bold, I can make it italics, I can make it underline exactly as in Word. I can do all these things in Excel. Slide two, slide three. Just a little recap. I can change the layout of any slide that's there already to whatever they want me to change it to. When I insert a new slide, I click on the little arrow and I can also change the layout of the slide that I want and where I want it.